working to bring comfort to those affected by the Sandy Hook Elementary School shooting. Students are being moved to a school a few miles south of Newtown, with decorations being made from all over the country, including right here in Kern County. 23 ABC's Carlos Correa is live at the Marketplace in Southwest Bakersfield with more on those efforts. Carlos. That's right, Kim. Area volunteers are creating paper snowflakes just like this one. Some personalized with messages that are all going to the students at Sandy Hook Elementary School. Some of these students will be able to see these uh, snowflakes as soon as classes resume in the new year. Rebecca Watson is helping create a little joy for the students and teachers at Sandy Hook Elementary School. I hope through this that it will ease a lot of their anxiety and tensions of having to go back to school, a place that they once thought was very safe and comfortable. Hopefully this will distract them enough to know it's a very um, uplifting, light school environment that I think it will be very magical, hopefully, for them. Watson learned of the request for snowflakes online from school leaders in Newton who are looking to create a winter wonderland for students. We as Bakersfield can kind of show our love and support to the children and the families there. It's an easy concept, it's an easy free thing to be able to do, but I feel like, you know, with our children, we're able to reach out to them as much as we can from so far away. The group, Snowflakes for Sandy Hook, is made up of Watson and her 10 year old daughter, Abigail. They're also working with area schools to create even more snowflakes. Pretty simple. You just can cut different designs through it. We've been teaching some kids who don't know how. The supplies used to create the paper snowflakes are being donated by area companies, all interested in providing comfort to a community who have lost so much already. I don't know. It just makes me really happy to know that other kids would be having a really happy time when they get these snowflakes and it makes me kind of happy to see that. People create their own designs and have the option of including a personalized message to students. It's devastating. It's heart-wrenching. I have a five-year-old that's the same age of these children as well as you know, three other kids that are all grade school age. And it just breaks my heart to see the faces of these children and to hear the parents' stories now of what they're going through and the grief that they have to deal with, especially at this time of year. Back here live at the marketplace where organizers will continue to collect these snowflakes. And if you're interested in joining the group or creating your own snowflake and sending it over, you can uh, go to our website at turn to 23com We have that information there already. Reporting live in Southwest Bakersfield, Carlos Correa, 23ABC. Kim, back to you. All right. Thanks, Carlos.